My name is Sydney Mickemeyer and I'm based out of Austin, Texas. My journey with photography has been pretty gradual. I was really into National Geographic and asked my parents for a camera and they got me like a little digital point and shoot that I brought with me everywhere I went. Yeah, it kind of became a way for me to interpret the world around me and it gave me a medium of exploration that I think I was really comfortable with and it really quickly became a dream of mine to become a photographer. It wasn't until college when I got involved with college radio and the DIY scene that I really started to feel more empowered to bring my camera with me to shows. The journey really started for me when I started tour managing for TC Superstar and I would bring my 35 millimeter with me and just kind of document them on the road and document them at shows. I realized how deeply I loved the conjunction or the fusion of music and photography. Every show that I went to since, I had my camera with me. The tour managing duties, it started off more of I'm tour mom. I make sure, you know, I have my, my doc, my Google doc that has like where we're supposed to be, when we're supposed to be, what all we need, etc. So making sure that we are getting everybody moving early in the morning and to where we need to go that night. Shooting live photos versus promotional photos and album artwork, they're very different experiences. Live photos, you don't have control over your environment at all. And I try to get myself in a good position and stay alert and stay ready. With TC specifically, I've seen them play probably hundreds of times through tour and I'm at most of their local shows. I have a real, really good feel for their choreography and am able to predict them, their movements. So I think more than other bands, I am able to put myself in a position beforehand and be ready for the stillness of a specific pose. Shooting promotional photos versus live photos, you have complete control over the positioning, the lighting, the setting, and you're really able to bring a specific idea into the world. I don't think I do have a preference between live shooting and portraiture. They're so different, but I love the intimacy of portraiture and the control of it and, you know, being able to really have that two-way street with the person or persons that are sitting for you. Shooting live shows is thrilling. It's just like a very... It evokes such different feelings because, you know, if a moment comes and goes and you miss it, then it's gone. So, yeah, it's just very different feeling, but I love them both. And I think that's why I love going on tour and doing the tour managing and the music photography, because I feel like I really get to do both of that. And it's more a candid portraiture on tour, but they're both so much fun and getting to do them with a group of people that you care about is just such a special experience. I really am so pro film just because the process is so much fun and like there's so much variability I think even more than digital from film camera to film camera. They're just there's an endless wealth of knowledge to learn about film and it's endlessly inspiring to learn more and more about the process and be able to you know, develop your own film and scan your own film and have full control over that process. Right now I'm working with Aaron Chavez who plays Keys for TC and Flyer Club. He is working on his own music releasing and we've been working on a long form photo project. He's actually my roommate too, so it's been centered around the house because that's where he made a lot of the music. Yeah, I'm excited to release that hopefully in the next six months or so. But ultimately, I think my goals and aspirations with photography are always just to work with more people and to tour more, <laughs> always to tour more. I think that music and photography and music photography are places for people to really freely express themselves and to feel openly and to feel supported in that. They're such supportive communities. The world has a lot to learn from these communities because they are so collaborative and here to uplift the members that are in them and in their places of radical thought. I love being a part of it. Yeah.